like cells which are important to live, teachers are important to survive. That was made by me. Hello everyone, my name is Deeksha from Park Public School. From the academic year 2025 to 2026, our school has arranged new courses such as NEET, JE and NEET for 6th grade to 12th grade along with NCRT. For 11th and 12th grade, we also have Home Science, French as well as Humanities. We have also experienced teachers for these special courses from next year. Now let us take a look at them. Hello teachers, my name is Deeksha. Could you please introduce yourself? Hello Deeksha, uh, myself Dr. Hariharan. I have completed PhD from NIT Trichy. I have research experience at Indian Institute of Science, Bangalore. So I have teaching experience for the competitive exams like ITJE or NEET. Uh, so over the past 10 years uh, at the foundation level as well as the advanced level. Thank you, sir. So could you please introduce yourself? Sure, Diksha. I am Ranjit. I completed my bachelor and master's degree and I completed my BA in mathematics also. And I got around uh, 10 to 12 years of experience in teaching mathematics. And not only in teaching, uh, I was also a content writer in major edutech companies and I was also working as a subject matter expert uh, in edutech companies which is integrated with AI. So that is my work experience. So That's now it. let us get into the interview. I want to ask you both uh, questions that almost every parents have. So as our school is going to give integrated courses from next year, do you think that in which way will it be effective to study here? See, uh, the curriculum is designed carefully uh, to align both the NCRT syllabus uh, that is required for the board exams, uh, so as well as the advanced level required for the uh, JE and NEET exams. Uh, so our highly qualified faculty members so will help the students uh, through in-depth subject understanding. So regular problem solving techniques uh, will give and also uh, though, uh, doubt clearing sessions will give so that uh, students can engage uh, more effectively, uh, which will be much easier. Uh, easily qualify those kind of complicated exams. Thank you, sir. Yes, so the teacher, next question. If you ask about in my point of view, see uh, individual attention, that is the very, very must effective technique, like sorry, effective uh, reason why you have to get into this integrated JE program rather than comparing to other uh, system. Personalized individual attention, you cannot get it anywhere else where you go in a crowd of 30 to 40 people. So that is our ultimate success uh, key formula. That's it. Do yeah. you think that our school students will get success in these fields, sir? Uh, see, when you talk about this success, we have major factors here. So the key factors are the student should be consistently making effort and he should be good at taking up the concepts. He should have an in-depth knowledge on the concepts. So that is that we will take it. And next, consistent effort. And apart from this, smartest strategies of uh, preparing for the exam, smart strategies. So that everything we will, from our side, we will take con complete contributions and we will give that also. And from student side, there should be some minimum effort of 20% is needed. We take care of that majority 80% and some 20% will be done by students and even parents also. So if everything is done together, Ultimately, it will lead to success. Thank you. So, so also, the, the test part is very important. So, we conduct regular test practice for the students. So, like the VT test, uh, the cumulative test, and the grant test. So, that will uh, so keep them engaging with the subject. So, that the practice will, you uh, know, makes you success. Thank you, sir. Yeah. So, the next question is for both of you. How do you keep a learning engaging environment? Yeah. I mean, you are asking in a classroom, right? Yeah. So when we talk about in classroom, when I uh, talk about mathematics, so see uh, usually math, you can actually it's a problem solving. So usually we will be solving problem, but our session is going to be even we can take it to the ground by making some pressure and kind of event where we will give small, small tasks to the students. In that particular task, we will make the students to memorize formulas. We make them to read the concepts. And we'll help them to apply over there, like uh, 10 concepts we have, surface areas and volumes, those formulas. We will make them to learn the concepts without even actually they are knowing that memorizing the things. So this is one way of engaging. And other ways, we'll make sure that at every end of the session, he has got every concept within his mind, like he has got everything inside. So that we will be checking in every end of the session. So obviously then student should ask to engage, otherwise he cannot answer that questions and he cannot uh, complete that session 100%.
so that is all about mathematics and in science point of view if you see yeah so when you come to the science subject no uh, so the practicals are more important uh, yes. uh, apart from the theory uh, to make engage the students so we conduct a regular practical sessions mm -hmm. so whatever they study in the theory part no so we give them experience uh, no uh, for the lab experience so that they can uh, demonstrate themselves and try to understand the in depth knowledge of the subject so that will keep them engaging and create more interest about the, the subject uh, so practicals will provide more engagement for the science subjects thank you teachers we have yeah. come to the end of the interview and thank you so much for your time